Hello guys, Dan here. In today's video, I'm going to be answering a popular question about graphics cards. That is, which ones are the best graphic cards in terms of the price performance ratio? Now I've done all the calculating already and made some pretty nifty graphs to show you guys today. So here's the first one showing all of the um, popular NVIDIA graphic cards. So I've worked out the price performance ratio by dividing the pass max score for each card by the price in UK pounds. The pass max scores have come from video cardbenchmark.net and to me is a reliable and unbiased website for GPU test scores and you can find the link for the website below in the description. Now getting into some analysis as you can see the mid-range cards are the cards that shine in terms of price to performance and with that being the GTX 750 and GTX 660 are the best Nvidia cards to go for if you want the best bang for buck as you Americans say it. Now the cards slightly below that are the GTX 750 Ti, the 760 and also the 770 which I personally have in my PC. Love the performance of that bad boy. Now after that all of the other graphic cards on this chart don't really make much sense in terms of price to performance and yeah I suppose you're kind of throwing your money uh, away in terms of the performance gain when you get more expensive GPUs, but uh, you know if you guys have got the money buy big graphic cards you might as well uh, yeah, you've got the money I suppose. Now this graph is available to download in the description uh, Same with the AMD one that's coming up just about now. So here we are These are the AMD graphic cards as you can see the mid-range cards are the ones that shine in terms of price to performance again and with this being the Radeon 260X uh, the 270 and 270X being the top cards here. And as you can see, the most expensive cards being the um, the Radeon 295, two, yeah, 295X2 and the 290X. Not making much sense in terms of bang for buck, but uh, you know, most expensive and the most cheapest cards don't really make much sense, to be honest, in my head. So that kind of leaves me with a conclusion. So if you're on a budget and want a GPU with the best bang for buck, simply go for the NVIDIA GTX 750 if you want to go with Team Green, or if you want to go with Team Red, feel free to grab the AMD Radeon 260X. There we are. However, if you're not bothered, and yeah, you don't really mind if you're going with AMD or NVIDIA, feel free to just get the GTX 750. And from my results today and some of the tests I've done, the yeah 750 is the card with the largest ratio for bang for buck. So there we are. And yeah, that's going to be about it, guys. Thank you for watching. Please feel free to like the video. Subscribe if you haven't yet. And yeah, let me know what video cards you guys are rocking in your rigs in the comments below. Anyway, guys, I'll catch you in my next video. Goodbye.